So that means it's time for the good, the bad, and the weird in that order, starting with a tiny Michigan hero who saved her mom, who was nine months pregnant when she started having a seizure at home. Luckily, her four-year-old daughter was there, stepped up big time. When mom collapsed, her daughter grabbed the phone, called 911, and gave the operator to her mom's full name and address. She stayed calmed and never once panicked. She's shaking, and she's having a baby. My mom is really pregnant, and she's having a boy. Okay. And she really needs help. How old are you, honey? Four. You're four? Yes. Okay. And I'm also getting bigger. Oh, the little girl stayed on the phone until help got there. She opened the front door. The good news gets even better. Mom gave birth to a healthy baby boy. Now for a really bad round of Wheel of Fortune. Two letters were still hidden in the puzzle, the painted desert. When a woman guessed the pointed desert, which was obviously wrong, but then the next player was even worse because he guessed the same answer twice. The pointed desert? No, still time. The printed desert. <laughs> James, it's your turn. The pointed desert. No, you still have time. Oh, I still have time. Yeah. I like to solve? Let me say it. The pointed it's desert. not the pointed desert. Oh, no matter how many times you say it. <laughs> Ooh, that was rough to watch. We all get annoyed when the TSA gives our bags an extra check. I know I always think, shouldn't you be looking for terrorists instead of my hairspray? Well, here's why they do it. The TSA just released its report on the illegal stuff that they found in 2014. There's a ton of it. I read through the report, and here are some of the weirdest ways that people tried to smuggle contraband through the airport security that I found. Some guy tried to hide an 8-inch knife inside an enchilada. <laughs> Another guy stuck razor blades inside a Scooby-Doo greeting what? card. And last, TSA found a boomerang disguised as a Batman logo. Pretty bizarre stuff. I hope, I hope they were traveling with kids, because otherwise that's kind of a dead giveaway. <laughs> that's true.